about you! Sickening stories of influenza for those susceptible to snorts and sneezes. <coughs> Kenneth the carer felt just fab, didn't think he'd need the jab, <coughs> caught the flu and fought it bravely, but passed it to Gran, who suffered gravely. If you get influenza, you could infect vulnerable friends and family who are over 65, have long-term health conditions, learning disabilities, are pregnant or are very young. If more people have the flu vaccination, the fewer people there are to spread the virus. A ghastly tale, one that's untrue, is that the flu jab gives you flu. You may get a trifling little snuffle. Better than off this world, you shuffle. You may feel a little run down after the jab. This is not the flu. It is just your system building antibodies to fight the influenza virus. Hear the <coughs> wheeze of asthmatic Max who let her flu vaccination lapse. Didn't think she'd need it yearly. She paid the price. She perished. Nearly. Each year, scientists predict what will be the four most dangerous influenza viruses that season and make the vaccine accordingly. Mrs. Alice Bingham Peebles said little George was afraid of needles. But that is no excuse today. No stabbing happens. Just a spray. Oh. Toddlers are super spreaders of influenza and are particularly vulnerable to the virus. To protect them, they are given a simple flu vaccine nasal spray, not an injection. The spray is also available for people with learning disabilities. It's not all gloom. It can end well. Just look at young Mina Patel. Fair ran for her flu shot while expecting. Wise idea. Baby needs protecting. Not only are you protecting yourself, your antibodies are passed on to your baby and protect it in its first few months of life. Our sickening stories have been told of influenza far worse than any cold. So be a hero, fight infection. Go and get your flu injection.